Well, time's getting shorter, isn't it, people? Well, thanks to uh, Joe Biden and Barack Obama's uh, chosen horse called the border, uh, it's going to affect all of us. Sooner or later, the crap's going to have to hit the fan. We've got, what, 8 to 10 million more illegals into this country than what we had. That means they got to be fed, they got to be clothed, they've got to have housing, they have food, water, medical. They're using more gas, more resources. And it's going to come to a point, because this is planned, <coughs> we'll get to the point where food becomes more and more scarce. Everything becomes more and more scarce because we have more people using it. That's going to lead to a conflict. And when you, when, you, when you start taking food away from an American woman's children, they tend to become uh, pretty violent. I look for kind of a civil war to break out what they want. They want to see this chaos and have uh, Americans, you know, after the the migrants and the migrants after the Americans. It's called survival. And when that happens, I look for somebody, either the president or some nitwit governor or some nitwit uh, mayor. They're going to say, oh, we need the United Nations to save us. We can't do it alone. That's how they're going to try and usher in the new world order. I look for this to happen. I really do. There's no other reason to let the people uh, across the border unless you wanted to cause chaos to begin with. It's not because uh, the Democrats are kind-hearted. <laughs> That's the furthest... That's the furthest thing from their minds. They're creating conflict. And if whoever, whoever suggests or brings in or says, well, yeah, it's okay, we'll call out the United Nations. These people will be considered traitors to the, to the United States of America. And I don't care who they are. If they're Democrat, Republican, they don't give it. Nobody cares. You're a traitor. The United Nations is not a neutral nation or anything like that. They shouldn't even be here. They shouldn't be upon our soil. They're a foreign entity. They're full of communists. So like I said, that's a Trojan horse. Here's what's going to happen. The United Nations. Peace through terror. That's what's going to occur. And if you think that my theory is far-fetched, let me know in a few months. You see everything going downhill, and it's going downhill for a reason. They could have stopped this a long time ago. They should have went through the normal zones. Oh, we got to fix the... Uh, Immigration is broken. It ain't broken. You just didn't use it. You wanted to bypass it like you're trying to bypass the Constitution. With your gun laws. How strange. But anyway, people, that's what I expect to uh, happen shortly. Like I said, our time is running out every day. We're getting closer and closer and closer to this. Like I said, anybody who suggests or brings in the United Nations is a complete traitor to this country and will be dealt with. American people aren't going to let this slide by. We let too much slide by now to put us into this position. People are starting to get hardcore. And that's not good. Okay, since they don't want to play nice, we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching.